start creating assignments, tests, and quizzes in a Noble course, we recommend that you set up your Grades tab. This is because in the Grades tab, you create categories and set them up so that you can put assignments into those different categories. I'm going to quickly give you a general overview of the Grades tab, and then we're going to have other videos where you can go specifically into more details about how to use this tab in Noble. So first I'm going to point out this little wheel here, this is a settings wheel, and if you click on that, you'll see a menu drops down with different options. The first option is categories, so let's take a look at that. This is where you will set up categories for your course. One of the following videos will go into that in more detail. The next one is grade display. This is the visibility of grades in your grades tab along with grade calculation. The next one is grade scale. There's no percentage scale default at Denison, so these are just some percentage scales that Nopal has put together. Nopal has some that have been preloaded. Also note, if you chose to have your grade tab display on a four point scale, that's what will show in the grade scale, scale here. Also note there is an option for a grade curve and you can set the curve amount right there. A few other things I'd like to point out is you can add a grade right in the grades tab. This is not an assignment for students, but if you set a due date, students will still see it on their calendar. So a good example of why you might create a grade is if you're doing something in class that you're giving a grade for or a participation grade. You might want to enter it here rather than creating a full assignment. Another thing you can do in the grades tab is you can download all of your grade data in a CSV by clicking this download as CSV option. Here you can see zero of zero grades published because we don't have any set up yet, but this gives you some control overall of if you want to publish or unpublish grades. Students will be able to see published grades and assignments. They will not be able to see your comments on unpublished grades and assignments. That's a general overview of the grades tab here. Now I'm going to offer a series of videos that go into a little bit more detail about all of those options we just reviewed. Please go ahead and check those out. Uh -huh.